Jared. Jared. Jeff wants to see you. Listen, Jared, do you know how long I've been at this company? A long time. Probably longer than you've ever been alive. 33 years? It's not the point. The point is, I know this company like the tip of my dick. It's like the Millennium Falcon to my Han Solo. I know when my Falcon gets a little loving. Jared, listen, we're in a bit of a rut. I'm strapped and regardless of what everyone at this company thinks, I can't save this on my own. I need a second hand man. And you want me to? Be my assistant manager, my uh, Chewbacca. Right. Is there a raise? No, but it's a stepping stone. And what's more important, you get the undying respect of all your inferiors. So what do you think? <clears throat> I'm, uh, I'm gonna have to think about it. Yeah, yeah, sure. Why don't you sleep on it? But uh, on your way out tonight, why don't you scope my brand new Ford Focus? It's the kind of luxury someone like me gets. Someone like us. In the door. What's up, pussy? How was work? What? How are you? You're me. I know. Crazy, right? I always thought I'd get better looking with age. I guess not. You gonna say something? How are you here? Maybe I'm a time traveler. Maybe you're just crazy. What if it's both? Why are you here? When was the last time you looked in the mirror? What? Look at yourself, Jared. You're working a shit job. You're living in a small-ass apartment. Just getting uglier by the day. I'm not ugly. You're in your mid-30s, for fuck's sake. You haven't done shit with your life. You got what? 20, 30 years left? I have more than 30 years left. And I've done plenty with my life. Thank you very much. You're an accountant, for fuck's sake. We have plans, man. Yeah, we... I had plans when I was a kid. I'm an adult now. I have to be realistic with my life. Yeah. Great job being realistic, dude. You got a one bedroom and a pre-owned Camry. That's realistic. No, it's cliche. Well, you said it yourself. I'm pushing 40. What do you want me to do? Quit my job and start writing music full time? Yeah. I'm not quitting my job. Why the fuck not? What the fuck? How'd you even... How can you keep a job you hate? I don't hate my job. Yeah, because this is totally what we wanted out of life. That's what we went to college for. Oh, fuck off. We were still writing music in college. A degree was just something for us to fall back on. Exactly. I fell back. It's not falling back if you never went for it in the first place. 
I still pursued music after college. Hell yeah, we did. And you are? I'm postgrad Jared. Can you believe this guy? Okay then, can you tell him that music wasn't an option after college? Uh, no. I'm on his side. You should quit your job. That way you can still die with some dignity. Well put. You know just as well as I did that my options after college were accounting or homelessness. Yeah, we had to take the accounting job, but you didn't have to stick with it. Yeah, and you would have plenty of downtime to write music. And you still have time to give it another shot. He still has at least like 20 years, right? Give or take. But you'd have plenty of time if you quit your job. I'm not quitting my job, and I stuck with music for as long as I could. What do you mean, as long as you could? Yeah. That was my bad, guys. Emily was like our top priority for years, and she wasn't gonna marry a starving artist. I need something stable. You disgust me. You're young, you don't understand. I understand perfectly fine that you turned us into that sack of shit. <sighs> Come on, man. We were in love. Everything else just seemed trivial. Exactly. No. Shut the fuck up. She left you. There's no excuse for not getting back into music. Yeah, why wouldn't you start writing again? Well, after Emily left, I was kind of in a rut for a while. Like, a year and a half. Fuck, you're depressing. Yeah, I kind of stopped working for a while. I got real into drinking at all hours of the day. I figured the only way to pay my rent would be to play online poker. Lost about 10k doing that. Then I just started selling all my shit. Uh, couch, TV, bed, fridge, whatever could keep me afloat. And then with all my free time, I decided to start writing music again. Oh. And that's when I realized I'd lost it. Lost what? Your mind? My spark. Whatever it was that I had when I was you guys, it was gone. Oh, bullshit. You don't just lose your creativity. Well, the guy's a fucking nut. Jared probably regained his creativity with the sanity. Yeah. What I was going through then doesn't mean anything about right now. Exactly. So if you quit your job now, you'll be able to completely focus. Problem solved. Yeah, problem solved. I'll just quit my job and become the next star everybody's looking for. You're a fucking selfish prick, you know that? I'm a prick for trying to earn a living? No, you're selfish for taking a piss on everything we wanted out of life. All of our passion, all of our planning, all of our work, and it doesn't mean shit to you. I just don't understand it. How can you continue working a job that gives you no fulfillment? And you're not even going to try to do something that will fulfill you? There's no more beer. Jared, just quit your fucking job. There's no more beer. That's all I want after work. A beer. I want to come home and have a beer. And you dickheads come into my home and you take my beer. And you say that I fuck my life up? Do I look like I'm happy? No, I don't want to be an accountant. I don't, I don't want to live in this apartment. I don't want to drive a fucking Camry. But lo and behold, and you say it's my fault. It's every single one of your faults. You, it's your fault for becoming an accountant. It's your fault for fucking everything with Emily up. And you, you little shit. It's your fault for even thinking I could become a musician. Look at us. There's nobody to blame but yourself. I swear to Hey, Jeff. Yeah, I know what time it is. Uh, I, I just, we need to talk. I've been thinking a lot, and uh, I really wanted to tell you that. Yes.
get those reports to you by, by Monday. All right. <clears throat> okay. Yes, sir. See you then.